All right, so watching people doing the lecture, I realized that people probably are having trouble. We'll have trouble with the density calculation. I should have walked you through them, but everybody was starting to glaze over a little bit. Okay, so let's say we have the element of surprise. Ah, okay, and its atomic mass is 60.2 grams per mole. Its radius equals 1.35 angstroms, and it's simple cubic. Okay, so what we need to do is to get density, we need to get grams per cubic centimeter. Okay, so we've got grams per mole, but that's not per atom. So we need to find out how much mass is in an atom in one of these unit cells, and then figure out what the volume is. Okay, so let's do the mass first. Okay, we know with simple, so we've got, we need to know the mass per atom. And then we figure out how many atoms are in a cell. So in this case, there's 60.2 grams per mole. And we can figure out how many atoms that is by 6.02 times 10 to the 23rd atoms per mole. And then in the case of simple cubic from our chart, we know that there is one atom per unit cell. Okay, so if you do that, then you get 1 times 10 to the minus 22nd grams per unit cell. Okay, so that takes care of the top part. The volume, <clears throat> we know that a simple, simple cubic um, uh, arrangement to the edge is equal to 2R. Okay, so if we cube that, then we get the volume is equal to 8R cubed. Okay, so... Now, probably the smart thing to do here is to convert this to cubic centimeters. Okay, so 1.35 angstroms. So we got um, 8 times 1.35 times 10 to the minus 10th meters. Okay, that's what an angstrom is. And we know that there's 0.01 meters in a centimeter. So you end up getting like 1.35 times 10 to the minus 8th. So you cube that. Okay. And... <clears throat> Number that you get if you multiply that. Whoops. There's 1.97 times 10 to the minus 23rd centimeters cubed per unit cell. Okay, so now we just to get density, then we take the mass divided by the volume. So we get Oops, I'm going to do the mass first. Okay, and then we want to divide that by the volume. So they're both tiny numbers. The answer then is 5.08 grams per cubic center. We'll do a little light for a metal, but it fulfills what we need. The element of surprise is not very dense, it's stealthy. So, all right, so the key here, places where you screw up, one, the units, the other then is how many atoms are in a cell. Okay, so that's going to differ depending on what the, um, what the unit cell is, what the packing arrangement is. And then finally, making sure that you just keep track of all your numbers. Okay, so, and, and not making a mathematical error. Okay, so that you notice in this calculation, there's no need for volume of a sphere. It's just not that important. So it's not part of this. Here it's just the unit cell cube itself. All right, so if you have any questions, again, please come and see me.